From today, SkyQ customers can access 20 extra live TV channels absolutely free of charge, plus over 10,000 hours of on-demand content. If you're watching this as a short, hit the link below to see the full version. If you're already watching the full version, stick around. More details coming up. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. So as I say, SkyQ customers can now access an extra 20 live TV channels with no extra payment required. Now, how is this? Well, it's been long awaited for SkyQ customers, but ITVX has finally launched on your SkyQ boxes. It started rolling out yesterday. That's the 23rd of February, 2022. Now, not everybody may well have the app. So what I would suggest is go into the app section of the SkyQ menu and see if you can find ITVX in there. If you can't find it in there, then you can try searching for it by voice. So to do that, grab your SkyQ remote control, press and hold the microphone button on the remote control and just say ITVX and see if it comes up. If it still doesn't appear for you, then unfortunately it hasn't come to your box yet, but hopefully should be there in the next few days. Some people have tried restarting their boxes and it's appeared. Some have tried it and tried everything, but it's just not appeared yet. But the Sky are in the process of rolling it out to everybody with a Sky Q box. So like I say, if it's not there yet, hopefully it will be in the next few days or weeks. As I say, ITVX did launch on various other devices back in November, including Skyglass and Skystream. Unfortunately, it's caused a lot of controversy because quite a few Humax boxes, apart from their very latest boxes on Freeview, are not getting it. Humax have stopped making boxes for FreeSat, so it's very unlikely that they'll get that on their FreeSat boxes. Also, people with uh, Manhattan Freeview boxes are still waiting, although you can go into ITV Hub and you do get most of the on-demand content, although not all of the live content. You only get the standard ITV channels. So let's have a look and see what channels, what extra 20 channels you get on ITVX. Now, with those two extra 20 channels, you also get the main channels, which are available on SkyQ anyway. And those channels are ITV1, ITV2, ITVB, ITV3, ITV4, and CITV. Now, what extra channels do you get? You get The Only Way Is Essex TV, Massive Laughs, The Chase, Loved Up, True Crime International, Love Island International, Crime and Drama, Hell's Kitchen, award-winning movies, classic comedy, Love Island, Vera, Saturday Night Every Night, classic movies, Out of This World, ITV Signed, which is good for people that are hard of hearing and deaf because it's constant signed TV programmes, World of Morse, Real Housewives UK, Midsummer Murders, and a relaxing channel, Unwind with ITV1. You've also got exclusive content like at the moment, Russell T. Davis's You and Me, Knox, the Rob Knox story, The Twelve, The Secret Lives of Jurors, Sam Neill stars in this twisty thriller, and also ITVX exclusive, Aspire Among Friends, Without Sin, Nolly, Loaded in Paradise, Litvinchenko, and many more to come. There's also an option to subscribe to ITVX. Now, what does that give you? That means there's no adverts because obviously this service is funded by advertising. But if you pay the £5.99 a month or £59.99 a year, then you won't get any ads. Also, you get BritBox as well thrown in with it. And you also get the facility on mobile devices to be able to download programs to take them away with you to places where you might not get a great internet connection and might be unable to stream them. So as I say, ITVX now available 
on SkyQ. If you've not got it on your box already, and you can't find it in the app section, then do try asking for it by grabbing your remote control, press the microphone button, ask for ITVX, see if that appears. If it still doesn't appear, try rebooting your box and try again looking in the app section and asking for it on the remote. If it still doesn't appear, then unfortunately, you're just going to have to be a little bit more patient and hopefully it will be with you in the next few weeks. And unfortunately, because it is a new app, there are some bugs in it. Some users have reported a few little problems with the service. So do bear with us. Let us know how you got on. Let us know if it's on your box or not in the comments down below. Let us know if it's working okay for you. It would be good to know. And don't forget, whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully, whilst you're here, you'll find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe even save you some more time and money. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, hit that like button. If you think your friends, your family, or your work colleagues might like it, then please don't forget to share this on your social media timelines. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you find out about all my latest videos the second they're released, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell, then hit all. You can also find me on Twitter at CWTech and my website at cwtech.co.uk. Liking, sharing, and subscribing really helps support this channel. Thanks for watching.